What am I doing here? What have I done wrong? I, I, I don't understand. I really need to add like a little fucking mouse in my chat. Or like mouse on my desk so like my hand moving looks less weird. Hammer space. Hello, gang. What's up, gang? Thanks for the sub, Advi. Do fish like snow? When melted, I imagine. Quite, I missed your last stream, but I'm here. I mean, last stream was good, but this one's a good one, too. Yeah, take a guess what I just did there. Take a guess. Hi, Alpha Quite. I am. I am an alpha male. I am a, I am a, I am an alpha male. Picture nose, among other things. What the fuck is smoke doing? The hands work. Yeah, they've been working since like last Friday, I think. They made their debut on the YouTube channel today, which is good. Like Funder said they don't look terrible when being edited, so that's that's solid with me. Look at my nails. Look at my nails. Aren't they pretty? Take your heat suppressants. None of that talk. None of that talk. I'm an I'm I'm an alpha male. I I I can tell you right now that I am an incredibly strong, virulent alpha male. It's like I it's like my blood naturally produces my bone marrow naturally produces steroids, with how huge I am. Are you sure? Well, we'll find out. We'll we'll get there. We'll get there. Should you take a shower or a bubble bath? I feel like the bubble bath would easy, be easier to watch a quiet stream during. Show, saying you're an alpha is a beta thing to do. Listen, be, the context of like alpha males and beta males is very different than the Manoverse one. We're talking fan fiction. We're not talking like Andrew Tate shit. You gotta understand. If y'all are unaware, the Omegaverse is a trope within fan fiction where characters have secondary genders. Uh, or it, like, in biologically, it means like if you're an Omega and a dude, it, like, they, you're like naturally inclined to like get fucked in the ass or something. In some universes, Pete, like, writers make it so men can get pregnant. It's crazy, man. It's crazy. I really cannot do mpreg. I don't know what it is. I really, I really can't do it. How do you know? Because I read it sometimes? Like, what did you... Did you expect me to deny it? It Like, I'm a pretty out-and-out -out fan fiction reader at this point. It's kind of impossible to avoid. Reminds you of your Baku Deco phase? Ugh. I don't want to think about that. Yeah, like, I, I can deal with the ABO stuff. But only the APO, not the MPREG. You can't even do regular pregnancy fix? I can't either. I don't know, it's just not like that appealing to read about to me. What's A ABO? Alpha, beta, uh, alpha, beta, omega dynamics. If you're an alpha, you're like naturally dominant and at the top of the food chain. Betas are just like normal people. Like they don't have any secondary characteristics. They're essentially like you and me. And then omegas is like, are essentially bitches, like you. I don't, I don't know, like, it, it depends on the writer, but, like, generally speaking. Kill yourself? What? What? What did I even, what did I do? <laughs> There's plenty of things you could reasonably point to and say, kill yourself over that quite. And I'd be like, all right, I get it. I just don't know what it was here. Yeah, the difference between folks who knew and who didn't know, like when they got the stream notification, was the speed at which they joined the uh, stream. 
Crazy stuff. Favorite read? I'm not fucking telling you. What? How much is ABO based off the defunct study about wolves? Essentially nothing but the terms itself. Like, there's like a bunch of tropes within that trope that have like kind of popped up within the community of writers who do it. It's like, ascent, like a lot of, some people write like interesting stories about like the social consequences of uh, something like that existing would be, but it's usually an excuse to write porn. Very rarely anything else. There was, like, a lawsuit about, like, a while ago, I think Lindsay Ellis made a video on it, about, like, if you could copyright the concept of the Omegaverse. I, it, it's, it goes on for ages. Whoa, cool stream? Thanks. I never get how Impred works. I'm a science nerd, so I'm like, wait, where would it be? Do they give Burtis that the ass? Some people go way too in-depth to, like, explain the mechanics and how they have room for the organs, and I just don't want to think about it. Like, shut up, dog. Don't tell me. Keep it to yourself. I'm not trying to know. The can shit went pregnant. Ah, oh, good lord. Ah, oh, god, good lord. Quite write a fanfic about it? Dude, I have like a job, you know, right? Quite, you act like a possessive bratty bottom omega. Please go outside. Please go outside. You know what I act like? Of an entertainer who's trying to play shit up for stream. Shut the fuck up and leave me alone! Uh, to be fair, I kind of asked for it this time. I'm literally making a video on this topic, so... Like, right now. I'm an outsider, this shit sounds scary. It's nuts. It is literally nuts. Give me a second, I need to make sure the cat didn't get into the food jar or the fucking food closet. Yeah, all right, you're good. You're good. Smoke is so stupid and silly. Where, uh, this work? Oh, shut the fuck up. So basically a week ago, I asked y'all for suggestions on personality quizzes I should take to determine on if these mechanics were real. Which I would be based off of the answers I give. And the truth is, I really don't think one quiz could ultimately tell us a, a definitive answer. I think it would take, like, a sample size, you know? We, we gotta average it out from, like, what the tests tell us, right? So... <laughs> I forgot to submit. We probably got most of the big ones in there. And here, here is... I want to start off with one that was probably rigged against me, if I'm being absolutely honest. Somebody made, a, a, like, one of these quizzes specifically for Quite. Let's be clear, this was made for Quite to take and is moderately cringe or low effort. Just a warning. Also, I'm meaner than usual in this, so that's my bad. And, and yeah, I don't know what the secret fourth option is. I'm, I'm, I'm assuming it's going to be me, and they're going to say I'm, like, the lowest rung on the ladder. Oh boy. Enter your name, quite. This is gonna be so much fun. Do you like quizzes with oddly specific questions? I barely do online quizzes, choosing an answer instead of creating your own cringe and fruity. I don't know, they make me feel stocked. I don't really have uh, an opinion on this. This feels like the closest thing to a neutral answer I can give. Pick one of my struggle meals to have for the next week. Instant noodles, but I made them way too salty, so I threw up. Hot sauce sandwich, just hot sauce. A pack of plain dry ass crackers. Cheap burger, but in the middle of music class, so the whole classroom smelled like oil. Or a sandwich made with traditional bread, Nutella, M&Ms, and cheap 
Murray? I, I don't think you spelt that right. I'm gonna be honest, I think this is more of an insight into the person who made this quiz's mind than it is anything to do with my personality, you know what I'm saying? Weird people keep saying Sigma? A tad. Cheap what? I have no idea. I guess, like... I, I don't go to middle school, or high school, or school at all. So I don't need to worry about the, the burger in the middle of music class problem. It'll just be a cheap burger. So I'll go with that. You're in a fight, pick a weapon. Thin stick you found on the ground. Brick's too heavy for you to pick up. Break the nearest object and use the shards. Your hands are bleeding heavily in not a sexy way. Mansplain, manipulate, male wife your way out of the fight. Your vibes are already enough they're an offensive weapon. A out of all these options, it seems like all of them suck. And I, j I just, like, put them up. I just put them up, you know? Like, I, I know what a box. I know The hand tracking's not getting it, but I can box. I, I swear to God, I am not fucking, like, holding my fist backwards. This hand tracking is just fucking up. I'm not doing this shit. This is a good way to get shot. Your vibes are already awful enough they're an offensive weapon. Yeah, just fucking, like, psyop a dude out of it. Choose a child to raise. Child neglect and suicide are not an option. Boy that grows weed and thinks he's the coolest in high school for being a, a like a pothead. Fem cell that hasn't grown out of her creepypasta phase and low-key stocked the malnourished twink in her classroom. One envy kid that every alt-right dude uses an alternate argument against trans rights. It, this seems like the least like problematic so far. What's the worst they got? They get picked on by a specific group of people? Astrology girl that dumped half the guys in class. Don't, uh, for S buy for the aesthetic, spends too money, much money on Robux. I had a specific person come to mind. Reddit son that thinks he's the best gamer for playing Minecraft on normal difficulty. Probably hates Insta and any hobby liked by 16-year-old girls. See, I'm going off this based on the ones that I think I could raise the best. And the truth is, I, I wasn't exactly this, but I was the closest to being this archetype. I think I, I think I could work with that. I think I could get him out of that. Like, it's not about which I think is the worst, it's which can I, like, successfully raise the best. Also, yeah, guys, first time since I've been back, but I am sipping on a beer. Lightly, we're not getting fucked up. Don't worry, but... You can fix him? I'm talking about my own kid here. So I'm gonna go with that. Speaking of FNAF, pick a character in the series to marry? Y yeah, like, come on. Pick something you got picked on for being in middle school? Uh, so autism symptoms, having a Sonic OC. This was curated for me. Pick something I own. A, lovey fi a Luffy figure, Luffy? That got the paint. I say it wrong every time I say it, and I find a new way to say it wrong every time I say it. Luffy, Luffy figure that got the panel that's head licked off by your younger cousin. Eight to nine triangles in a pencil case that you keep stealing. The stinkiest, mustiest Hello Kitty plushie in existence. Oh, I know you fucking smell. Old receipts hidden in my phone case. I'm taking your fucking pet canary. That sounds sick. ABO like the basic poodoo you are. Poodle. Tags that are just the author ranting like it's Tumblr. Body horror paired with reader has autism and so it's cool and sexy of them. Slow burn. I like I like a long read. Something that occupies my time because searching on AO3 is a fucking chore sometimes. Like, trying to find the next thing that'll capture your attention, like, the way that previous ones did. So if it's a long one and it does the trick, then I'll be good for a bit at least. What genre do you listen to? Too much rap. It's getting harder for you to not say slurs on accident in normal conversations. I'm gonna be honest. Rap's my main genre. That hasn't been an issue since I was, like, 16. <laughs> No music, just podcasts, TikTok, rap, I guess. I don't listen to metal or that much pop. Spamming memes. Spilling the hottest... Wait, what's your role in a friend's group chat? Spamming memes, spilling the hottest scalding tea like it's private DMs. Spectating and occasionally sending a skull emoji. Definitely not the normal one. And I don't mean that in like, I'm so different. Just in like, a, I'm very, very stupid. The one who keeps leaving whenever they're slightly mad. Um, uh, probably the occasional skull emoji is the closest. When you're playing a game, what do you have in the background? Nothing? I don't know how you do that. Uh, gun reloading comps in a call with other people. 
I want to say usually I'm in a call or the equivalent of a podcast. So like I listen to music a lot when I game, but like a podcast as in an hour long video essay. Probably that. But it would be one of these two. Roblox gun reloading compilations are some shit I put on while also on calls. So I have something visually stimulating. You stand before God to answer for your sims, which are William Afton glitch trap shipping. Bullying someone in middle school. Unironically liking podcasts. Saying a bad word singing along with rap. Killing your friend's dog in Minecraft whether intentionally or not. This is the one God would bring up in front of me. How much do you all actually do online quizzes? Barely. I'm not going to say never because like, come on, man. I'm not fucking, I'm not immune. But generally speaking, I have more uh, preferred ways of wasting my time. Saying the bad word, but not because I'm singing rap. Damn. 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 Alpha male Giga Chad quite streaming. I get. I guess I should pick that one. Because that is objectively what I'm doing, right? Like, objectively, right? <laughs> Final pick question. Pick a hyperfixation I had. Detroit Become Human, Undertale, Sonic Racing Game, Doctor Who. Trying too hard to befriend everyone in second grade. Undertale's the best one. But you gotta, you gotta get some, you gotta get some better ones, man. It's right, become human. Oh boy. I'm not adding you on Twitter. Beta male. All right, all right. Beta, beta. Normal ass dude, normal ass dude. We'll go with that. That wasn't me sucking dick. Stop it. Beta male. Guys, you have to understand, beta is just being a standard ass individual. Like the type of person that exists in real life. You're an alpha, like, you have, like, issues. Bro can't even have kids. I can have them the normal way. What do you mean? What do you mean? I just can't give birth to them, and I'm fucking fine with that. Pre like, give me... I'm, I'm just saying, pregnancy sounds like a pain in the ass. Like, I I'm good. What is this quiz called? I don't know. It was made specifically for this stream. It's crazy. Bros have, bro have sex upside down? What? Imagine being the stale white bread of ABO. Honestly, like, considering, like, half the shit that goes wrong in those universes, I'm good. I'm good just being a fella. Alert your husband of your normalcy? What? Fuck you. Thank you for inventing the, mega, the Omegaverse. I'm not taking credit for that shit. I refuse to take credit for that kind of thing. Even as a bit, I'm not doing that shit. Alright, what's next? Which Omega rank, Omegaverse rank are you? Too many unfunny clowns have made bad ones with the intention of shocking people with how weird and freaky it is. So as a genuine Omega, I'm making a good quiz. F like, this person identifies with that strongly. Favorite emoji in this lineup? I love... I love, like, the fucking flat-eyed one, but, like, with the eyes open, like, where it's just, like, a neutral-ass face. Not Shrek-sucking, not the dick-sucking Shrek. Let's go expressionless. Are you a furry? I'm a monster fucker. <laughs> I think Bowser is hot. No, but I like anthropomorphic animals. I'm gonna let... let I, I have, like, four videos titled Monster Fucker Dating Sim. Like, what, what's, what's the excuse here? What excuse do I have? Literally married a whole, like, a fucking... Literally dating a horror game icon. Did you go to art school? I did not go to art school and can't draw. What's my least favorite one? Bond slash link slash soulmates? Enemies to lovers? Bed sharing. I think arranged marriage. I just don't enjoy those, like, in the slightest. Well, what's next? Least for- yeah, Expanding penis slash size cake. There's a lot of fucking bad ones here, though. Like, I, I think it's gotta- I think it's gotta go with, like- Oh my god, that's- That's bad. That's bad. 
Oh, I, I don't even, I don't, oh. Sex pot, one of these is not that bad. Like cuckolding in waters, at least those are real. In like, like at least those are real. I, 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 dude, something about eggs. I just, I cannot stand it. I cannot stand it. It like, there's something really specific. What the fuck is cuckolding? Like a cuck. I can't like. Ugh. Which of which of these most fits you? Any female born after 1993 can't quirk, can't cook. McDonald's, charge your phone, twerk, be bisexual, eat hot chip, lie. I'm gonna say probably lie. You like podcasts? I like true crime talk show. I like YouTube Let's Play slash Twitch streams. I only really listen to Joe Rogan. Um, I, if I listen to any, it's gonna be like a talk show thing, like just some fellas, like probably just a couple white dudes. Favorite piece of werewolf slash wolf shifter media? Uh, no, 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 no. Not familiar, no. She-Wolf, yeah. It's a fucking banger. What are you gonna do with it? What are you gonna do about it? If you had to taste... God damn it. God damn it. Do you know the amount of self-reporting going on because I recognize these terms at all? Do you understand, like, the amount of self-reporting? If you had to say someone else is slick, what would you hope it tastes like? God damn it. God damn it. This was such a bad idea. This was such a bad idea. I'm a moron. I mean, if it's going to be wet, I want it to be like... Something that matches the texture. Kombucha? Who the fuck is trying to taste... And who would want cum to taste like steak? I don't want, like, juice to taste savory. What is slick? It's like natural lube. <laughs> uh, plain old pussy flavor? Yeah. I, I'm sorry, I'm not adventurous. Have you read fan fiction? Whenever I want to jack my huge meat. Like a couple times a month or so. I write, I write my fiction. Almost every night is a bedtime story. Not so much recently. But like when I get in it, I'm in it. I'm in it, man. I've been doing crosswords recently, though. What position do you sleep in? On my back like I'm dead in a coffin, tucked in so I cannot move. On my side while holding a pillow. Uh, either on my back like I'm in a coffin or while holding a pillow. Favorite wolf species? I fuck with a timber wolf, I don't know. Imagine you're an o omega slash alpha is recently presented. What do you do? Take advantage and bask in the uh, attention. Utilize all bio biology neutralizing healthcare available to live as a beta. Hide my scent. Not hide anything and just live my life. Um, honestly, I got shit to do. Like, dog, I'm a I'm a career focused fella. I got shit to do, man. What the fuck is this quiz? Hell, bro, I got like an I got like another like big ass video to make. All right, which of these am I picking? The Fool, The Lovers, The Tower, The Chariot. I don't really know much about tarot cards, so I don't even know what they all mean. Maybe Judgment, because I'm a commentary channel and that's like my job. Would you kiss your homies goodnight? Yes. Yes, but the homies are so long distance, I'll kiss them through the phone. Yeah, I live on Discord. Fuck it, Christ. <laughs> Alpha! Yeah! Yeah! You have a huge fat knot and a ridiculously virile. Yeah, what What do you- Dude, look at me. I got huge tits. <laughs> That's a fucking incredible choice for that. Guys, I'm an alpha male. I. What did I tell you? What did I tell you? I'm an alpha, dog. I'm literally- I'm literally top of the pack. A whole paragraph. I'm not reading the rest of that. Incorrect liar. How, how are you gonna know better than me or the quiz? How you how are you gonna tell me that? The li it's lying. Do it again. Don't worry. We so l l let's tally them. Let's tally them. Let me let me like get a Google Doc and we'll see how many we were getting per per result. Quiz. 
quiz tally. Alright. Okay, so here's what we got. Here's what we got so far. Here's what we got so far. So far we have... One for Alpha. One for Beta. Alright? And we're, we're tallying it up. We're tallying it up. Rare Wobox, be damned. Them titties are huge. Why not add a counter on stream? I don't have it set up. Plus, the Google Doc is... I already set up the Google Doc, so I'm not, I'm not doing it again. What's your favorite color? Orange, gray, pink. Just like hives? I don't have a favorite color. Green's not even an option. Neutral colors. Green's not even an option. I guess I'll have to go for orange. What would you do if you saw your friend getting bullied? Make a chart to see how I would prevent the bullying. If that didn't work, then I'd step in. If it didn't stop, then then I don't know. Run the other way. Talk to my friend, and if that doesn't work, tell a responsible adult. I would try to teach them to tie a noose. What the fuck? Ask bully to bully me instead? That's stupid. Beat their family to a pulp and show it to the bully. Okay, yeah, you're up your own ass. I would anonymously post about what they're doing with their- Dox them? No, I'm good. It, give a pep talk to the bully. That'll- that'll fucking- yeah, that'll work. Run the other way. Probably talk to my friend because, like, handle it person to person if you can, but... You know... I- <laughs> What animal would you have pet? A boar, a shark, a horse, raven, fish, a lizard, a bulldog, any animal from the shelter, a wolf dog. I mean, these are just the closest to dogs. What kind of food do you like? Sweet foods, salty food. We're savory. Whatever has the most protein. Ooh. Yeah, where, where the fuck is, like, steak? Because that shit ain't sour, that's for sure. Fatty foods? I don't know. I eat a lot of fast food. What kind of music do you listen to? Undertale OST? Why is rap get up one selection and then Wilbur Soot in Dream each have each, like their own options? What the fuck is this? <laughs> Good lord. Wilbur Soot, help. Johnny by John Cage. This quiz is insane, uh, easily. Rap, I mean, yeah. What role do you play in games? Uh, it depends on the game. I'm a pretty basic bitch. Like, I I'd go for, like, I, I had, like, a pugilist class in Final Fantasy XIV. What's your favorite movie? James Bond, Bridget the Holiday, Fight Club, Marvel, Studio Ghibli. Ghibli? Whichever one. Uh, out of these... I think the ones I hold closest to my heart as a universe are is Star Wars, because I just grew up on that shit. What's your favorite Harry Potter house? None. Harry Potter is stupid. Do you have a long dick? Per perhaps? Uh, why? Yeah, that's probably why I, what I'd answer. What does your room look like? Pick the most similar pick. <laughs> the fucking prison cell! Oh my god! Yeah, I listen, I, I I got billions of dollars, but not this kind of billions. I want to say... None, yeah. I had, like, dude, I don't st spend a lot of time in my room. It's like a bed, a dresser, and then there's nothing on the walls because I spend all my time in my office. I don't know. Wait, I, I guess the prison cell, man. I don't know. D's. Sad face. Enigma. An enigma is the alpha of alphas, and is believed to be a myth because of the rarity. They are extremely dangerous. Wow, dude! Wow! Wow! Y'all were there with me. Y'all saw me give the- y'all saw me give it. That, that- that's classified under alpha, and- or some shit. Giga, we're finding out how manly I am. Apparently, apparently I'm hard as fuck. Apparently I'm very, very, very... Loud, incorrect buzzer. Y'all just don't know me as well as you thought. I'm just saying, like, you thought you knew me right, but you don't. You don't. It's fucking capping. I'm answering these honestly. I explained all my reasoning. It's the rap. 
Come on, gay people listen to rap. Bottoms listen to rap. That's stereotyping. That's messed up. Hacked. God, y'all, y'all just can't accept the truth for what it is in front of you. Now that's some weak shit. That's some weak shit. All right. Ugh, Omegaverse rank quiz. Getting the common questions out of the way. Are you an introvert or extrovert, or do you feel like a bit of both? I feel like introvert leaning, but like a bit of both. Favorite animal out of the ones provided? Antelope, cat. Cat, because I have one. What what do you tend to do in a stressful situation? Breakdown slash let my emotions get the better of me. Do my best to get a handle on the situation without my emotions getting me. Uh, definitely this top one, because my emotions getting the best of me is like a, a, an ongoing battle, you know what I'm saying? It's like, I'm obviously attempting to reel them in, but like, I feel like I can't reel them in until you let them flow first. You know what I'm saying? You are Omega Bottom Lies. I think y'all just headcanon too hard and forgot that there's like an actual human sack of flesh behind the VTuber. <laughs> when put into the role group, what role do you find yourself in? Supporting roles such as the scribe or helping with ideas? Um... When put in a group, like, what do they mean? Like, do they mean, like, when other people are assigning you to the group? Because the only situation I really have like this now is, uh, like, my YouTube channel. But, like, that that's mine. So, of course, like, I'm running that one. I'm going to say supporting role. Like, people, like, will ask me to show up for stuff. And I'll do my, and I'll usually show up on time. So usually. Sometimes I'm late. How much work do you find yourself doing in group projects? Somewhere in the middle. Somewhere in the middle. I do my best at not slacking off. I tend to do a lot of the work. Doing the bare minimum in somewhere in the middle I don't think is the same. The bare minimum is still like on the side closer to not doing jack, you know? How the fuck do bits work? Hey, fuck. Hell if I know. I do my- I'll say I do my best at not slacking off. Now which do you hope you get? Hands up, hands up. You are the bottomest of bottoms quite. If you're an alpha, then I'm a tortilla. How would you know? How Maybe you are a fucking tortilla. I have no way of knowing if you're not. You said it yourself. You, you called yourself that, not me. What am I hoping for? Definitely not hoping to be the one that gets, like, held and comforted by a big strong man. Definitely not that. Finally, since it's late, though this may be updated, here's the final question. Fate? Fate? Beta, beta, beta. You saw that? Saw what? The answer? Yeah, I, I got another tally on the beta. Currently trending towards alpha. Currently trending towards alpha. Bro's getting a bit defensive to not be hiding things. I'm getting defensive because you're fucking stupid. <laughs> now that's true. Free from the Omega curse, bless you. Pick a color. All colors have meaning. Which one do you feel the most drawn to? Uh... Uh... I can't... I, I, for some reason, I, 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 I'm I saying green. I, I couldn't tell you why. What travel sounds best to you? Save the rainforest in person. Fuck no. Private tour of a museum. Paddle the Grand Canyon. Drinks with friends on an island bar. Massage by the beach. Dr drinks on the island bar sounds great. What's your idea of a fun time? Hanging with friends, gaming, stay at home at chill? Depends on the night. Uh, it really did, like... I think some of the most fun I've had has been doing... has been spent doing all of these things. Like, I stay at home at chill in game. I, I feel like gaming is the most consistent one. Pick a piece of clothing you can't live without. Damn, I wonder. Damn, hoodies. I, I, I wonder. I wonder which the floating hoodie is gonna pick. The living hoodie. I which one he can't live without. Wow. What kind of grades are you pulling? I'm not in school anymore, dog. I I think it was like A's and B's, occasional C when I was. I'll I'll say like most oh wait, was it? Dude, it's been so long since high school. I've been out of high school for longer than I was in high school, which is fucking weird now that I think about it. It was mostly A's, I think. But there, like, was an occasional C in there. Uh, yeah. I also didn't take the hardest classes, so that's alright. 
Describe yourself. Adaptable, leadership oriented, accountable, team player, motivated. Hmm, which way do I want to suck myself off? In a way where I could suck myself off. I'm adaptable, I think. Pick a spirit animal. Hedgehog. Sonic. Shadow. Shadow. Pick your ideal date. Back row of the movies. Picnic. Jazz club. Going to the beach. Dinner at a nice restaurant. An outdoors adventure. I think I'd, like, if I went on an outdoors adventure, I'd be tired as shit and not want to talk. Going to the beach would be pretty sick. Pick a celebrity crush. Chris Evans. Duh. Which are you? Leader? Follower? Only a leader when I need to be. Yeah, like... Obviously, I run my own channel, but... You know, I, I'm not trying to do everything out here. Though This won't affect your result, but which would you like to be? I don't know. Why, why do they include these ones if, like, it's not gonna matter? Like, what's the point? What's the point? I don't get it. We're gonna go neutral. Submissive beta? Luna love gun? What? What the fuck? Never one to pick to pick a fight without reason or hang with brutish alphas. You can calm any storm in any situation. What? It's still it's still beta. It's still beta. They're just like fucking putting on all these like adjectives that complicate the things. Why is Luna there? I don't know. I don't know, man. I'm dead. I'm dead. Literally, I'm a corpse. Submissive, inbreakable, quite. Listen, it's still said beta. This is like. In this. In universe, I'm like the normal type of submissive, not like the fucking genetically predisposed to be submissive. Submitted and readable. Loud, correct buzzer. Submissive, but not breedable. Quite's losing alpha type. Shit, you're right. I think they lied when they said it wouldn't affect my outcome. I think they're a liar. That means you made that choice to be submissive. No, I, no, I didn't. Just admit you like being held. I mean, yeah. It's pretty good. Not submissive, very breedable. What is going on with my hands? I don't know. My, my tracking's being a little wonky today. I think I need to mess with the positioning later. Looks like I'm looking for uppies. You are an Omega? Dude, the, the facts don't lie. We've taken how many of these? I've answered, I've answered honestly. And, and I, I, you can't help it. I'm just that, I'm just that guy. You're doing a group project. How do you contribute? I like this question more than what do you, what amount of the work you do. Immediately get your friends who you know you can work with well and create the best project ever. You force your way into leading the project. End up wishing you picked another group. Somehow you end up organizing it. Hey, smartest person, if we work together, I have an empty apartment and will provide pizza and emotional support. Um, I use, I, I use like, even like modern day stuff. Like when I'm working on videos or bigger projects, I try to work with people I already know or who are referred to me by people I already know. Because I feel like, I especially with like creative process stuff, it's easier to get like, get the motion going, get the ideas flowing when I'm working with someone I know sort of deal. You had a bad day. What's your go-to method to make yourself feel better? Stress bake and feed an army? No. Favorite PJs? Grab your comfort movie and wrap yourself up? No. I, how dare you even suggest you ignore? Call a close friend or family member and rant about your day. You get into a fist fight? No. Pick out a movie you know will make you feel worse and don't leave bed for 12 hours. Probably call a close friend, talk about it for a bit, and then hop on Halo. I don't know. What did you want to be when you grew up? Or closest equivalent? Homemakers? I, I feel like writer's the closest because... I'm not going to lie, most of the work I do for my job now is writing. Like... I, I write the long video, I write the jokes, I write the tweets. And I'm not gonna lie, being a bookshop owner, if I, like, as, like, to pass the time when I'm, like, rich as fuck sounds pretty good. Greatest fear? Being alone. The dark? Gra okay, I understand being the scared of the dark, even as an adult. 
But like as your worst fear, as your worst being alone, disappointing someone. Um Hmm. Man, this is fucking personal, dog. This is personal. Ain't no way. I'm freaking scared of being alone. I feel like disappointing someone goes hand in hand with being alone. Being forgotten. Like, dude, that's, that shit's gonna happen. Like, whatever. I'll be dead. Everything I've ever made and ever done will, like, end up having little to no consequence on the greater scheme of society. That's cool. I'm just here. Like, I'm just trying to enjoy the time I got here. Whatever. But... Yeah, being alone, probably. Quite right side as material. I didn't know you knew how to do that. Do you think I just, like, riffed the entire, like, the, the entire two and a half iceberg video? Pick a thing you were way too into in middle school. Emo bands. Harry Potter. Greek gods. Emo bands. The concept of Japan. Um... Definitely not BBC Sherlock. Probably the concept of Japan. That's when I got into, like, anime to start with. And that... It, a few wrong turns, and I could have been, like, a lifelong weeb. A few wrong turns, and it could have gone very poorly for me. Pick a line from a poem. It matters not how straight the gate, how charged with the... How charged with punishments the scroll. I am the master of my fate. I am the captain of my soul. Nobody heard the dead man, but still he lay moaning. I was much further out than you thought, and not waving, but drowning. The entire history of human desire takes about 70 minutes to tell. Unfortunately, we don't have that kind of time. That's funny. Futile, the winds, to a heart in port, done with the compass, done with the chart. I don't get it. No flowers in antiquity, but boys' bodies pale perfectly imagined. So the gods sank to human shape with longing. In the field in the willow grove, Apollo sent the couriers away. And his merry bosom swells with the Pain of the bells. He dances and he yells, keeping time time in a sort of runic rhyme to the pain of the bells. A girl and Poe is just a nut job. Uh, um, uh, let's go for the sad, depressed shit. One skill you could master you don't have right now. Instrument. Cook. People forget me. Make people do what I want. Make anyone my friend learn any language or languages. Probably languages. That seems like that's the... That's, like, the most irreplaceable one of those skills, I think. If you found out it was your last day to live, how would you spend it? Partied up, do whatever I want. Do what I always wanted to, but was scared to. Make amends. Stay home with my family. Do whatever I want, and that would probably involve partying. Probably. Like, just, you know, on pure chance, I reckon. Stay home, why wouldn't I? I don't know, man. I do that every other day that I'm alive. Plus, it's a great excuse to make anybody come out no matter what's going on in their life. Oh, you're going to say no to my death day party? What the fuck, dog? The thing is, I wouldn't want to just party it up. How do you make friends? One friend and slowly become friends with their friends. Not really sure. It just kind of happens. Join the clubs or activities and make friends through events. Find someone that looks cool or has slash wears merch of things you enjoy and strike up a conversation. I feel like I usually, like, I make friends these days by meeting friends of friends. Like, I've met several people organically, like, through clubs and shit. And then I meet other people through them. You're, you're kind of, you're kind of right. You're not really sure. It just kind of happens. Like, I'll meet someone and then I might not see them for, like, six months. And then as time passes, we see each other more and more, and, like, we have a long history that's, like, slowly converging into being more intertwined, you know what I mean? Do you think crying is... A, when I say going to, like, clubs, I mean, like, shared interest groups. Uh, strength. Crying is just crying. It doesn't mean anything. It doesn't mean nothing. I'd say probably strength over weakness, because... I mean, if you hold it in for too long, I feel like that's not gonna help you much. What are, where are you when there's a party going on? In my group of friends having a good time? In the corner, checking your... F I feel like I'm pretty... I'm pretty likely to, like, end up circling back to my friends. But I feel like I meet new people pretty often. At parties. How do you pack when going on a trip? The day you leave, throw everything in a suitcase and go. You pack over the course of weeks? Nope. Pack weeks ahead? Couple of days beforehand? Nope. Um, I, I always, like, pack the day before. But that's because I pack light enough that 
like, I, I know I can get it all done and have the checklist filled out, and that's fine. You have checklist, you have everything you need for emergency, you were super prepared. Adding things as they come out of the laundry is a good, you might have a checklist to make, but if you... Yeah, probably this couple of days beforehand, that's probably the most likely one. What is your dream home? High-rise penthouse. Somewhere close to the sea. In the city, close to work and all the places I need to be. Small idyllic village. Somewhere in cool isolation. Um... I'm not gonna lie, like, I'm gonna say the penthouse. Because that's just the best version of this one. Realistically, this is the one I'm aiming for in my life. Of course, this is the one I want. Like, who- I'm not gonna say no to a fucking penthouse, dog. It's in the city already. I'm trying to have a social life, and that's a pretty good one. What designation do you think you'll be? <laughs> uh, definitely an alpha. That's why I chose alpha, because that's what I'm gonna be. Which type of character do you identify with? The person that dies in the first episode. Minku Muzi, quite his arms. Re recent development here, recent development here. The fuck? And yeah, this hand tracking positioning is rough. What type of character do I identify with? Person, not the person that dies. The best friend, the love interest, the antagonist, the anti-hero. The hero, cough, the chosen one. Hey, come on, you know me. Fucking up my own ass, huge ego. Dude, I'm literally him. Favorite fan fiction trope? Found family. Fake dating. I don't like, I'm not really for fake dating. Dark fic? I don't like things being dark for the sake of being dark. Enemies to lovers, not a huge fan. Found family for sure. Biggest strength? Your acceptance, intellect, ambition. Spontaneity. My ability to make friends. I don't know. I don't know, like, I don't know how to gauge any of these things in my own person. Do you like fluff? On occasion. I, I can only stay in so much at a given time. I was never book smart, I'm money smart. Makes me more intelligent. Your intellect, your big brain. Has anyone been to Iceland? Uh, I had a layover there on the way back from Greenland. Probably ambition. What would you guys say? What would you all say? I, I feel like some of these I need to defer to y'all. I think you fit ambition. I do be do I just I do be just doing shit. To be fair, yeah. Last question. Tell us if you enjoyed this. Qu no, I'm not doing that. What? N what? What? What is this? Who? F who rigged this? Who rigged? Who put this together? Who rigged this shit? What is this? This is, uh, this is the first one, I guess. This is the first one that you guys think was correct. An outlier. An outlier. A statistical anomaly. It's bound when you're working with large sample sizes for some of them to get it wrong. These things happen. That's okay. You know, it, it, this quiz clearly wasn't up to snuff. I, I... Listen, these things happen. These things happen. These... Listen, these things happen. I am not... I am not an Omega... Only correct one so far? Oh yeah, because it confirms your preconceived biases. You're just mad at the sample testing. Isn't isn't on your isn't in your favor. Also, I should probably right align this. Okay, this was two. What the fuck? What the fuck does right alignment do? Okay, I'm going to center align these, actually, so y'all can see them. Okay, 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 okay. Okay, just one. Just, just one. Before we, uh, take the, uh, last half of these, though, I am going to take a quick pee break. Uh, give me money. Look at this ad.
Hey guys. I think it's fucked up they made the heart on the screen. I think one of y'all put this thing together. And that they said Omega and Happy about it? How would you know? <clears throat> Thanks for the 1,000 bits, Bingus Colin. You're gonna give me a tumor quite? Going to? What is your Omega scent? I feel like this is, this is like kind of an outlier one. Let's take that. This assumes that I'm going to be an Omega. We're not taking that. We're taking that last. What Omegaverse rank are you? What positive traits would you say you have? Multiple selection. Uh, hard working? I think so. Like, you can always do more, but it's not about always doing more. I think I consistently do a good amount of work without, like, fucking not having any time for myself. Uh, all of these, really, really, all of these, yeah, all of these, really. I say you're very confident. Yeah, I'm going to defer to y'all in these ones. Why the green fingernails? Wow, quite is so humble. This is incredibly true. I would say I'm the most modest person there. Probably organized? Uh, I wouldn't say so. Shit's all over the place for me, man. Okay, we'll go with we'll 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 stick with these four. I don't wanna I don't wanna like toot my own horn too much. What negative traits would you say you have? Um definitely impulsive. Uh non-committal, physically weak. Arrogant? I don't think so. Um uh Moody? Moody? What do you mean, moody? Probably a bit self-conscious. Physically weak? No, I'm strong as fuck. I'm huge, dog. I've, I've beaten most YouTubers in arm wrestling, alright? Indecisive? Uh, that's definitely one of them. Yeah, I'll, I'll, I'll check Moody. I, I remember I have outbursts on stream for sure. Even KSI? Relax, relax, relax. Moody definition is you? Okay, that's fucked up. That's an exaggeration. That's an exaggeration. Are you sure you're not physically weak? Do I need to pull up the fucking pictures on my forearms? Dude, I'm huge. Well, not like huge, but like I got a little going on for myself, alright? It's not nothing. Like, I'm not, like, ridiculous, but it's not like I got nothing. I didn't realize you would read that. You put it in my chat! What the fuck did- What, what, what did you think was gonna happen? Like, dude, remember the fucking vascularity on these forearms? Pretty good. Pretty good. Pretty good. Like, I'm sorry. I, 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 got, I gotta stand my ground. I gotta stand my ground. This is an open carry state. Give me your workout routine. Uh, I go on walks. I'm not going to lie to y'all. I, I only really do like bare minimum exercise. Like I try to stay active. Like I go, like I walk multiple times a week for a while. I just kind of, I just got lucky with the genetics. I'm not even going to lie to you. It's not really like a workout routine thing. I'm just incredibly fortunate. Snatched waist. Let's go, King. Yeah, y'all, y'all fucking changed your tune so fast. So fast. One paper cut and you die. Probably, yeah. Fuck, this is a long one. What animal type do you identify with? Big mammal. Rideable animals? <laughs> Probably like a rodent. I feel like a possum. No, possums are marsupials. Sorry. Ideal pet. Cat. Because I have one. If you owned a dog, what would be your favorite activity? Not giving them a bath. Going for walks, playing fetch slash tug. Definitely that one. It's fun. It's, I don't know. Which major arcana card do you vibe with? Do I vibe with? The world? Oh, she got her titties out. I can't show that. The hanged man. 
This dude looks cool as fuck. I can't even lie. The Fool. It's about what I vibe with, not what y'all think represents me. The Hanged Man looks nuts. That's that's my G. How do you sleep? Zero blankets, just me on a mattress. Naked. I sleep in my underwear. In with shorts on sometimes. In a shirt. Just depends, like, what season of the year it is. Like, right now, I'm fucking layering up. Under the cover with a pillar or two. Several blank... Nah, dude, I don't like getting... I don't like getting too... I don't like getting too, uh... Sweaty in my sleep, because I wake up feeling gross. But not... Like, so not a weighted blanket. Where is, like, just the sheets and the comforter, like... The majority of America? Under the covers with a pillar or two for my head? Yeah, yeah, no, that that's correct. That's correct. What position do I usually sleep on? Straight like a log, lay on back. I usually fall asleep laying on my back, but I wake up, like, on my stomach. Like, holding the pillow. Lay on side. Probably constantly shifting. What color are you most drawn to? Damn, I want to- Guys, guys, which- Guys, which, which is quite good to pick, I wonder. Gu guys, I have no idea. I have no idea. What are you afraid of? Part one, being ignored, failing, not being understood, hurting people, uh, not being strong enough, being alone, not being taken seriously, hurting people mostly. Uh, what are you afraid of? Part two, crowds, clowns, the dark, blood, germs, small slash tight spaces, public speaking, heights. Yeah, man, I, I have like, I have a really funny rock climbing story when it comes to heights. I, I don't know if I should save it for like a dedicated thing because it's actually pretty in-depth, really funny, but like has had lasting effects. We'll just go with heights for now. Maybe I'll tell it like when the video section's over because if I were to do something with it content-wise, I, I wouldn't want it to like be in like something else too much. Please explain the story. All right, so when I was in like, I think it was like fourth or fifth grade, I climbed up, like, a column in my house, and so my parents forced me to, like, take rock climbing because they thought that would be, like, a good physical outlet. And it was good for, like, the first year or so. But I think eventually it, like, was whittled down to just just me, the only kid going there, and one instructor left, and it was, like, this off-duty Marine. And he was so fucking strict. He was cool. Like, he liked Call of Duty. Like, we, we would talk and shit. But I just don't think he understood the concept of my limits. So, like, he would make me, like, he would tell me, like, okay, you got to hang upside down on, like, the underside of a wall when I was, like, 10, 11. And I would be up there genuinely crying, shaking. And, like, he still wouldn't let me down until I finished it, until, like, the second time when he realized, like, and, and my parents just didn't understand, why don't you want to go so bad? Like, what, like, we're, like, we're just not going to let you quit. Like, and it fucking sucked. It fucking sucked. And... Every time I see somebody, walk, like, specifically rock climb, I get a really specific tingling in my fingers that I always get before I would go to those classes. It's like, I don't get it with, like, parkour. I don't get it with, like, seeing, watching people free run. I get it with rock climbing. And, and like, I, I just am way more scared of heights than I was before then. Which is funny, because I still like cliff jumping sometimes. <laughs> And that's on trauma. Like, genuinely, like, I, I, I like, was so... I, I would literally use any, like, injury I would gotten the day of I was supposed to go to, like, a, a rock climbing class to get out of it. Like, I, I'd say, like, I don't think I can go use my feet today be, like because, like, something happened. Like, I would just try to get out of it because it was... I was genuinely terrified. Like, also, undiagnosed anxiety doesn't help, but... Chat, is this trauma... Hello, ad friendly. How are you? How are you? Are you in therapy? I mean, I, I already talked about that with them like ages ago, but yes. What do you do in your free time? Multiple selection. Okay, okay. I wouldn't consider cleaning, organizing things my free time. They're just something I do that makes me feel like I'm put together. But if I didn't have to, I wouldn't. Where the fuck is gaming? Where is gaming for gamers? 3D crafts? Fuck no. Going out with friends if I can help it. Um, social media for sure. 
This is the closest to YouTube, so I'm gonna pick that one. Uh, yeah, that's like the main ones in here. I can't cook. I don't like reading. Reading. Fan fiction. Right. No gaming for quite. What scent are you drawn to the most? Is fuck- is like diesel exhaust on here somewhere? I don't- I cannot tell you why, but I am- I love the smell of like the fumes that exhaust pipes give off. Gasoline smells so good. I don't know what to tell you. Gamers with G-A-Y spelt out. Yes, I love gas smell. I know this is not a new observation, which is why I was comfortable sharing this. Because so many people in this chat definitely feel the same. It's giving pica? Pika? I don't know. I agree, but it's really unhealthy. Well, it's fucking everywhere in the air. What am I going to do about it? Fresh, like, clean conjure or, or cotton. Aquatic, earthy, sweet or sugary. I have a really poor sense of smell. But I do love, like, aquatic smells. Like, I love the beach. If you could live anywhere, where would it be? Reasonably comfortable, small house, big city. Probably big city. Or anywhere near my loved ones is the real answer. But, like, I love the culture that comes with a big city. I just need to know people there. Like, it's more important to know people. But if I could know, if I knew I would know people there, the big city. <laughs> you find out it's your last day you live. What do you do? Oh, this one's familiar. Do and see as many cool things as you can. Prepare for funeral. Partying hard till the end. Think about your entire life. Go out and hang with your friends. Try to prevent your death. It's knowing it's inevitable, you have to try. Say goodbye to everyone you know. Um... I'm gonna say hang out with, like, my friends and family. Like, these go together, I think. Um... Uh... Quote of quiz default question. Say friends, I guess, because they're the more immediately accessible. Invited to a friend's house. You know a few people, what are you gonna do? Not... Drinking! Definitely! Woo! Dance like no one's watching. Try to find a polite, explore in the house. Making sure my friends don't get too drunk and are safe. Fuck no, dog. Do I look responsible enough for that? Nah. Become the DJ because your music's awesome. Explore the house. I'd probably stay by my friends and then meet new people, like, through the ones that they vet. Or, like, they already know or are, like, conversating with. Stuff like that. Of the options there. Someone you know walks up to you one day and confesses their love. Asks to go on a date. You don't really like them back. What do you do? Tell them you need time to think, say yes to a date, not to make them feel bad, say yes. Yeah, tell them I'm not interested, still like to be friends, as long as they can respect that boundary. There's no reason why you can't stay friends. You see someone flirting with your partner in the distance so they look uncomfortable. Wrap your arm around your partner to hint that you were together. Join the conversation and casually call your partner a pet name. Suddenly get your partner out of the situation without making it awkward. Yeah, that's probably, that's probably the best option. Like, it diffuses the situation without, with, while ending it, and getting your, like, your partner out of, like, a bad way, like, just seems to make sense. You're waiting in line and someone cuts you and takes your place. What do you do? Tell them they should be paying more attention to move. Say nothing because it's just one person. Inform them where the back of the line is. I'd probably tell them they cut in line, but they're like, What's it to you? And I'm like, whatever. Like, I I'll probably be like, give them be the benefit of the doubt that they didn't know, and that if they're going to be a dick about it, I really cannot be asked. Thoughts on having kids? Not sure. I have no interest. I just want to give my love to others, kids or no kids. Not sure about kids. Um... I'm not sure, honestly, about having a kid. The idea of being a father has, like, adopted or otherwise, like, has, like, I've certainly thought about it. I feel like everybody does in some capacity. That's kind of how you figure out if it's for you or not. What, what if it's a weird pet name like Stinky Feet? Well, that'll get them away from them real quick. Children are disgusting. Listen, we may, we've made a lot of jokes about punning babies on this stream, but we're taking this seriously. We're taking this seriously, all right? 
quite the third. Well, who's the second? Maybe in like 10 years. Yeah, we'll see how I'm feeling when I'm like 40. Uh, I don't think spring trap is good with kids. Okay, now you're ba now you're making real life assessments based off the fictional media they starred in. That's fucked up. That's parasocial. He's more than the character, all right? He's more than just the character he played. No interest, but if my partner won one. I think if I didn't have kids, I'd probably like try to get involved like in like local community stuff. I'll say that because I'm not like I'm not choosing the option with a colon three on it. A stranger that you're attracted to flirts with you. You do not have a partner. What do you do? Flirt back just for fun. Get flustered. You won't agree to do anything, but you're not exactly saying no. Walk away. Try to casually get away. Pepper spray. You're giving your friends in the tone to leave you alone. Uh, probably like just kind of feel it out. Like not saying no, but you do have a partner and are in a serious relationship. What do you do? Um, tell them to leave you alone. Hoping to get something. No, I'm not fucking cheating on my partner. Do I look stupid? Flirt back, get flustered. Politely tell them your relationship. Probably just tell them I'm not interested. Like, I don't gotta make it about having, like, a boyfriend or some shit. Just, like, I don't wanna. Your model's hands are really nice. Thank you. I have specific... Do you have goals in life? Specific career goals. Planned out step to get there. I will go for whatever interests me as long as I know I can be successful doing it. Honestly, I feel like I checked that one off. Like, it, sure. Like, I still have, like, the realities of the American economy to worry about. But the lens I view them through is through content creation, which is like what I've wanted to do since I was like seven. So yeah, that I, I got, I got that. I want a family and su support enough to live comfortably. Basic idea of want to, I know I want to do what makes me happy with the people I love around me. Yeah, pretty much that, pretty much that one. Big spoon or little spoon, I don't mind as long as we're touching. Uh, little spoon. Come on. Everybody wants to be the little spoon sometimes. How do you feel about marriage? I don't see a reason to, only if I feel... I don't like... It's not even about commitment, it's just like... Marriage is like a legal concept, but I don't know. I'm... I guess like the... Probably this one. Oh my... Bottom of the pyramid when it comes to the right. This is bullshit. This is bullshit. Those were beta ass answers. That's fucked up. That's fucked up. That's fucked up. Now that's fake. Now that's rigged. Now that's rigged. Guys, you need to know I'm only taking this Omega scent quiz if like it tallies up to be mostly Omegas. Right now, betas are betas in the winning. Betas in the winning. I'm just. That's all. You said little spoon. What did you think? There are men, there are men in straight relationships who want to be in the little spoon. Don't act like this is a unique phenomenon. I put that in there specifically to mix it up a bit. Well, that would that would be that's assuming the the outcome before it happens. We all want to be pound pounded. Some people want to do the pounding, otherwise there'd be nothing for us out there. You understand this, right? Just let it happen? Okay, so that sounds very non-consensual. That feels very dubious consent right there. Not cool. We got to do Spotify rap submissions this year. We did that last stream, actually, if you wanted to check out the VOD. The video for that should be out on Monday. Omegaverse quiz. Find your APO rank 100% accurately. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're not the only one who said that. When I enter a crowded room, I usually... I feel like Blend did. Like, I'm I'm not exactly shaking in my boots these days. I've definitely gotten some confidence about me, but... I'm not exactly the center of attention, I don't think. When it comes to my appearance, I think I'm... Good-looking, ugly, or lovable. There's like... There's like... There's like no room for nuance here, is there? These are really obvious. 
What would ugly even be in the context of this? I can smell the beta on this one. Uh, well, it's... Uh, these ones seem ass a little bit. Lovable? Lovable? What are, what are y'all saying? Well, I mean, guys, look at me. Look at me. Look at, look at, look at how fucking, like, doughy-eyed I am. It's crazy. I love being in charge of things. It depends. I prefer hug and be hugged by. Yeah, that sounds right. I like my partner to respect and love me during intercourse. If I were to roleplay, I'd like to be none. It could be hot to tie your... What is... Uh, this is just like a sex kink quiz, isn't it? In it. In it. To tie your lover? To be tied by your lover? I... I don't fucking know. You think I... Bro, you know this. I ain't... I ain't be fucking nobody. I don't know. None of the above. I got no answer here. Sometimes I think about blindfolded being... This quiz sucks. This quiz sucks. It is so... This is just a sex kink quiz, guys. We're qu I'm sorry, that one's too bad to continue doing. I'm not doing that one. It's just kink territory. It's just kink territory. Bro, the pictures? Like, I'm sorry, we just can't even count that towards the tally. I think vegetarian is, is, vegetarianism is stupid. I mean, no. I'm not gonna do it, but I get it. Uh, I have a strong sense of justice. I'd like to think yes, generally. I'd like to think that I fight for the right thing, but obviously there's, everybody's going to have personal failings there. What in the Wattpad is that picture? Um, well, you said it. Wattpad. I don't patch, pack much luggage when I travel. I think I... No, I, I usually, like, fill my shit to the brim. I can't pack as light as some of my friends. I am easily hurt. Uh, I'm gonna say not sure. Because in most circumstances, I think I got thick skin, but in others, like, I'll crumple. I prefer to others in leadership roles rather than to lead. Um. Um. I do like being in control of my own shit. But, like, I'm more than fine if I'm, like, playing a part in something else someone is organizing. If it's, like, something I came up with, I obviously want to be in charge of it. But if somebody sees a role for me in something else they're making, I am more than happy to just be a part of something bigger, you know? Um, not sh I feel like not sure is the closest I can get to that. I often take friends, my friend's problems to heart. I would be a great president. Uh, uh, duh! Duh! What the fuck? What are we talking about here? What are we talking about here, dog? Dude, I literally... Listen, listen, listen. I killed Bin Laden. That was me. That was me. I am a great president. What are we talking about here? What are we talking about here? Do they know who's taking this quiz? Of course, yes. I often find myself acting as a mediator when conflicts arise among my peers. Not really. I don't know. I feel like they usually, like... Most of my friends just talk it out themselves. <laughs> it's easier for me to feel the real nature of a person subconsciously than to understand them. I'm not gonna lie, like, the, like, the, like this kind of thing where it's like, I just get bad vibes. And like, they have that confirmed when they like say that about everybody. And then like, one of them ends up being really shitty. Like, I, I really don't like folks who are like, oh, I can just like feel it. Like, I just have like a sixth sense. Like, no the fuck you don't. Like, shut up. You are just as, like, fucking... Like, you can use actions and deduce things from those. But, like, feeling the real nature subconsciously, it just feels, like, so pseudoscientific. I hate that shit. No. When someone makes a rule I don't like, I am tempted to break it. Depends on the rule. It just, it just feels like people saying, yeah, I'm an empath. Yeah, I'm an empath. Yeah, I'm an empath. Yeah, I just feel things that other people feel. I just, like, know it. When someone makes a rule, I don't like I'm not. It's definitely not a yes, because it depends on the rule. 
But like some rules are there for like safety reasons, even if I find them annoying to things I'd like to try. I'll say not sure. I value cooperation and harmony in my social interactions. Generally, yes. I often feel the need to take care of others. Um, only insofar as like that I'd know they'd take care of me. Like, I, I like, I'm going to say yes, generally, but also because I'd hope like, you know, they do the same sort of deal. I trust my instincts and I'm not easily swayed by the opinions of others. No. I second guess a lot of shit. I usually say it, stay calm even when the environment seems nervous. Um, I think it, again, I think it depends. I'm an empath. I sensed your Omega and, and like we just said, you're full of shit. You just eat Chipotle because you're full of shit. Balanced person. Yeah, man. It's like, I don't know how to describe that. I'm just like a dude. I still have and treasure a few of my childhood cho toys. Yeah. I usually stay calm even when the environment seems nervous. Yes, not sure, no. Usually stay calm even when the environment... I'm gonna go with not sure. What qualities do your colleagues value in you? I have expertise and can address intricate challenges. I can think on my feet and am decisive. I think I'm a decent communicator. I think my people skills are like a lot better than they used to be. Um, how extensive is your circle of friends? Honestly, these days, I've just met, like, so many people who, like, because they've ended up, like, in the same sphere of the internet as me, it, they've kind of been filtered to be more in line with my sensibilities than, like, people I just meet on the street, you know what I'm saying? So at this point, it's kind of numerous if we're counting internet folk. Uh, how might others characterize you? Or, or regarding looks, I perceive myself as ordinary. Uh, how might others characterize you? How how would you all, out of these three, which which would you all, which would you all, which would you all pick? Self-assured or courteous? Oh, we're getting all three. That's so nice of y'all. Self-assured. <laughs> I do have a, I do have an ego. That's for sure. How do you handle stressful scenarios? Middle ground. In which area do you believe you need self-improvement? Probably patience. Which holds the greatest significance in your life, loved ones? Beta! Woo! Another for the betas. Woo! Another for the betas. Bro assured himself right there. Muddy. I'm s Basic beta L. What the fuck does beta mean? Just normal ass dude, I guess. What ABO dynamic are you, but it's subtle. Somebody kindly remove my lungs. Also, shout out to y'all's feedback. All right, guys. I'm going to run another ad break because I like money.
you slow down, I'm feeling haunted. Dude, I, I, I cannot, there was like some funny shit I saw yesterday. I hope y'all enjoyed the ad as much as I did. Yeah, I mean, you are friendly to him. Guys, I saw some of the funniest shit ever that after like the main chunk of the stream, like this bit, I have to see if I can find it again. Jack Manifold reacted to Digital Footprint on stream yesterday, and he was just flabbergasted. I, 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 I had forgotten some of the lines of that song, and I, I, I don't know what I was thinking when I wrote it, but not in like a bad way. Oh my god, no way. <laughs> Dude, I, I, I gotta pull it up after this. It was really funny. All right, all right, all right. But in the meantime, let, let's, let's, we got three more, or two more left. Jack Manifold, yep, you heard right. How much do you like the word tiny? I call people tiny? Why would you think I want to be tiny? I use it for objects. All right, this is too horny. I'm more, I'm more ashamed about it at least. Somebody just took your seat, glare it and glance over. If they don't, you deal with it. Excuse me, I think it was sitting there. Would you mind moving? With a sweet inflection? I don't care, they can have it. I'll just find a different one. My friend kindly fucking your buttocks for my chair. I mean, what's the context? Was it like a chair in like a public space? Also, I'm stopping the hand tracking because Leia's like gleaming a little ring around my neck. I'm going to unplug it. Sorry guys, head only for the rest of the stream. I'm I, I the thing is I wouldn't do that last one. That's just that's just too much for for what a chair? Get over yourself. Even if I really wanted that seat, I don't care, they can have it. I'll just find a different one. Excuse me, that's my seat but with a sweet inflection to smile. Excuse me, I think I'm sitting there. Would you mind moving? Probably like this one if it, the situation came up. What's your favorite smell? My partner? Fuck you. I don't have one of those. Petrichor, the smell after rain. I love the word petrichor. It's so sick. Fabric softener and detergent? Not really. Out of these, my favorite is probably food. Like, good food. Choose an as tea product? I don't, I don't drink tea. Pick a type of fanfiction. Porn with plot. I need my fucking preceded by a detailed fictional government system. <sighs> yeah. Listen, sometimes, sometimes I need just porn, but like, I need a mix. I'm gonna be honest, like, it, it's just pacing, man. It's just about pacing. It's just about pacing, that's all. The sex just needs to be there to break up the really serious bits. It's not, it's not because... I'm beating my dick to it. It's not, it's not, it's not, it's not, it's not. Self-report. This whole, tr this whole stream's been a self-report. What do you mean? I need the porn with plot. The, the plot makes the porn better. I need social commentary in between smut. Extremely defensive there. At least I wasn't defending myself against something. I was defending something I admit to liking. Somebody makes a move on your partner. You, if I know they're okay with it, touch them. Make it clear we're dating. I'm secure in my relationship. I don't care. Glare, act like a possessive fool. Passively, aggressively. Haha, ha, what partner? Should I just say, haha, ha, what partner? Or answer this as if I had one? Because this kind of feels like a cop-out, but it's also the most accurate one. Quite a bit too honest with chat. Have you seen For the Record, dog? It don't get much worse than that. It don't get much worse than that. S Bro, what about Springtrap? Oh yeah, Springtrap. Springtrap, yeah. Sorry, sometimes like I try- I forget I'm not hiding the relationship from the public out anymore. Uh, act, um, I'm secure. Whatever. Pick an animal. I like all animals. Dog. A fish. Big dogs. Tons of them. I will surround myself in fluffy love. I'm... Honestly, like, I don't have a preference between cats and dogs. Only the workload that comes with one or the other. 
Like, I love dogs. I think they're so cute, but having one is such a different experience from having a cat. Like, my cat's just fucked off and chilling in the corner. Cat. Cuddling. Cry instead because everything's on a cactus, but actually I crave affection. Sometimes I need it constantly. Other times you touch me to rip off your fingers. Fuck! Nap time cuddles. At night exclusively. 24-7. Uh, probably his top one. Pick an article of clothing, worn soft tees, sweaters, one specific panel, joggers, sweatpants. I'll fuck with a soft t-shirt. I look like a cactus? Yeah, I was I was thinking like, it's kind of appropriate for my VTuber model, you know? You're stuck in traffic? Man, I knew I shouldn't have stopped. I will control the situation by uh, mild frustration. Yeah, pretty much. As like... Traffic has bothered me so much less as long as I have a long enough video I'm interested in playing. Because it means I just, like, I don't know, I get I get to, like, chill with some shit playing. It's worse if I'm listening to, like, a playlist while I drive. Because just listening to a song while you're stuck in traffic feels weird. But if it's, like, a good video, like Caravan of Garbage from Mr. Sunday Movies, that's some good shit. All right? Those, those are good vibes. If they're pettable, I will pet them, but, like, in a casual way. Spoil them. They deserve it. Walking time, oh, they're good from a distance. Um, with other people's animals or wild animals, very casual. Like wild animals, I'm gonna be honest, I'm not touching, but in like I in a I respect their space sort of way. Like I like animals as beings with a level of autonomy. You know what I mean? It, it it's like I can't really expect every animal to be petable even if I think they look extremely pettable. And that's cool. You know, that's, that's, you know, that, you know. It's like, it's like how if you're, if you don't, or like, if you, if you're someone who complains about cats because you had a bad experience with one, they were, when they were clearly giving you bad signs. Like, I'm not going to lie. That's kind of on you. Like, that's not on the cat. Like, I've been scratched by cats and I'm like, nah, I pushed it too far. That's not on me. Or that's not on them. It's fucked up. Bears look like that and I can't hug them. That I agree with. Water? Uh, I brag about how hydrated I am. Sip, sip, motherfucker. Please no, I'm so cool. I drink it at a healthy rate. Um, sip, sip. Like, dude, I have two fucking tall ass G-Sups uh, shaker cups that are just filled with water. I just, I use these things to, because of the biggest containers I have and I can fill them with water. That was half the container. How do you sleep? Uh, this is my bed, and if it's not right, I will not sleep in it. Face up, I don't move at night. I don't know, I just sort of vibe. Yeah, I'd be... I'd be flopping around, I'm not gonna lie to you. I watch a show, I binge watch, I die for it. You binge watch, change it every two seconds, get distracted, and let it run for like 20 episodes, and oops, now I gotta start a new one. Sit down and focus on a few episodes. I, if I'm into it, I will binge watch it. And that's the only time I consider myself as actually watching it. For real, if anyone says all water tastes the same, like, no the fuck it don't. Yeah, some of that shit is poisonous. Beta. Beta. Okay. 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 Guys. I think, I think, I think a pattern's emerging here. You, okay, we got one last one. We got one last one. Choose a color, any color. Green. This is probably gonna be a shit quiz, too. You reach into the toolbox, the first you withdraw is... An adjustable wrench, a pair of needle nose pliers. I mean, it's probably this, because, like, I don't like nose hair. What animal would you ride in the Grand Canyon, USA? I don't know, the most practical and readily available one? What the fuck are you saying? When facing a black bear, your first instinct is to close your tent flap, ignore it, figure out if you run faster than that guy right there that you hate, to pretend this isn't happening, to play dead. Um, probably like freeze up and die. Shout and wave your arms to drive it off, I guess. Is beta below Omega? No, it's like a normal ass dude and Omega is like submissive and gay. 
Uh, just one ticket for all expenses paid. Island trip for two to three people. Where are you going? A place of history and beauty and hopefully a nightlife. Your ideal Friday after a busy week includes unwinding, crawling under a blanket, picking the club you and your friends are going to hit up. Yeah, anything with friends, really. Choose a trait you feel relates to you. Caring towards others, inquisitive. Enjoys debating? No, that shit's stressful. Agreeable. Inwardly focused. Have strong opinions. Why does an alpha in the kitten way? Um... I'm not gonna lie, I, I feel like inwardly focused. I, I'm a little full of it, let's not be- let's not lie. But it goes on a pizza. Meat. Yeah. Beta. Yep. Guys, the results are in. The results are in. I really wish there were, like, more quizzes that, uh, didn't have a beta option because... Everybody on Earth is actually a beta because that's just, like, normal people. On Earth. It, it, it like I feel like some of these quizzes should be forcing you to be in one or the other because most people are going to be betas because they're essentially stand-ins for what normal people in the real world are. The thing is like I'm going to here to be fair I'm going to take one tally off of beta and give it to omega because it was submissive beta. And that feels like some, like, a quiz that just wasn't willing to commit to, like, being one of them. So, we'll, we'll say, well, you know what? You know what? But we have, to, we have to keep in mind that one of the alphas I got was the alpha of alphas. So that's another, that's another, I'm just saying, I'm just, no, I'm kidding, I'm kidding. Is it beta brand? <laughs> Is a beta brand to be Omega? Are you, are you saying, like, LeBron James is an Omega? The ego glazing is insane. Yeah. You are not an alpha? Yeah, I'm just kind of sick as fuck. And that, that's the more important denominator here. Anyways. The final results are in. Uh, inconclusive. Because none of this was real anyways. <laughs> Uh, anyways, did you know if you are watching this on YouTube, you actually missed out because this was streamed live on twitch.tv slash quite where I stream on Mondays, Wednesdays, and Fridays. You could have been here. You could have been here. I'm just saying, you could have been here. I don't know what's going on with hand tracking today. I think the thing's overheating. I might need to clean it off or some shit because it's wonkier than usual. Hey, yay, yay. All right, all right. Before, but let 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 me find the uh, let me find the, <laughs> the fucking Jack made a full clip. He his. Oh my god, he 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 had he just had like a not a stank face, but just a, well yeah, flabbergasted. That's the best way I can describe it. Let me see. Let me uh, try to find it real quick. Oh, yeah, you fucking heard, you fucking heard how flabbergasted he was. All right, let me uh, reframe this real fast so y'all can see the whole thing. This thing, this was really funny. He didn't his even. Stuff, his album is so good. He didn't even know I made his album this song. Is so good. Uh, digital footprint. Sit that on, see what that's like. Uh, <laughs> let's see what that. Let's see what's that like. The the lobby just start in a minute, so this, this, we've got to be quick here. Oh wait, this is quite. And, and seeing this in top two for him, he, he I don't think he understood. Wait, did it. I? He didn't fuck with the vision. Immediately! Immediately! What? Was there an Epstein bar? Oh my god, I'm trying to buy that private island off of Epstein. Gotta bet, get my pick. That is a wild lyric. <laughs> 
Oh my fucking god. You gotta admit, I'm gonna try and buy the private island off of Epstein. Like, that's, 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 I, I like that. I'm, I'm proud of that rhyme scheme. Oh my god, I don't own Lethal Company. He didn't even own, like, he was like waiting to get in the Lethal Company lobby and he didn't own it. Right, let me install the game, shall I? Right, the game's downloading in the meantime. Probably turn off the background music. Plenty place to roll, but my heart's still empty. Making money off of these kids like I'm Nestle. Smoking on this wood got me. That's probably one of the better bars in there that, like, just toes the line without going over too far. Tired of the waist be playing me. No one knows me right away, the hoodie's lefty. You're an NPC and I don't do quest free. Ball say looking like a fork is from Wendy's. His dick crack my back like an old school death seat. When he's done using me, I won't be left standing. Fine boob, I forgot about that. We still expanding. Love being a sheep, only do shit with his training. Look at his face. Look, I, I, I'm gonna, I'm gonna make you look at his face. Like a four piece from Wendy's, his dick crack my back like an old school death seat. When he's done using me, I won't be left standing. Got a ton of yarns, but I won't be left standing. Oh my fucking god! I seen full of panic. My gun was crawling back like my hairline. That's why I'm covered up during airtime. My face like bandies. Only care about myself. I'm worse than Greg. I can suck my own dick cause I was born to late breach I can't waste your time like you're trying to make the death seat I'm a legalized child labor don't let me <laughs> What? This is- the, these lyrics are fucking mental I suck my own dick cause I was born to late breach That- that's crazy. All of this is crazy That is cr I'm a legalized child labor don't let me That is crazy. I- I want- I- 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 <laughs> I think he liked it, guys. I think he liked it. I think he. I think he thought the song was good, guys. He's like a parent reacting to their child's music, dude. I had Wallace's dad listen to one of my songs, and he's like, "You know, it's not for me, but there's clear thought there. I don't want to know what the thoughts were, but there's thought." Professionally flabbergasted. That's a way to put it. Oh, all right, guys. I'm gonna run an ad break before I wrap the stream up. Find someone to raid. Thank you guys for coming out tonight. It's been fun. I'll see you all in a minute. Please stick around for the raid. Who's live even? Nuka's live. You can throw it his way. He is smoking weed, though, if that's a sensitive thing for you. Oh, he's playing Overwatch. Nope, he lost it. Let's raid Jack. Let's raid Jack Films. He's watching YouTubers' videos, giving critique and all that stuff. Very cool series, I think. I really like the premise of it, and then he made, like, an iceberg shouting out some of the folks who sent in their stuff recently, I believe. I think the whole idea behind it's really dope. All right, fellas, get in the Jax Films raid. Get in the Jax Films raid. All right, I expect every single one of y'all in here, otherwise y'all hate minorities, blah, 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 gay people, women, uh, Asian people, Filipinos, um, what else? Uh... Sexy people, because that's what I, that's one of the things I am. Uh, yeah, get in. I'll see, either way, I'll see y'all on Monday. Out. Oh my gosh! All right, fifty-three thousand viewers.